Welcome to the rocket profile for the Electron rocket, Moon Express's ride to the moon. The Electron launcher is being developed by Rocket Lab in New Zealand and it will be launched from New Zealand, but the closest I could get to New Zealand here was Wimira in Australia, so sorry for that. The Electron is essentially a miniature Falcon 9 in its design. It has nine Rutherford engines on its first stage and then a single vacuum version of the Rutherford on the second stage, with kerosene and oxygen being the propellants throughout. The Rutherford engine is unique, however, in that it is an electrically pump-fed engine. It's the first rocket engine to use this cycle. The diameter of the rocket is 1.2 meters. It stands 17 meters tall and has a mass of 10.5 tons, making it nearly the lightest orbital rocket ever. The Lambda 4S beats it with a mass of 9.4 tons. But while the Lambda 4S with its solid fuel stages could carry 26 kilograms to orbit, the Electron rocket can deliver 150 kilograms to sun-synchronous orbit thanks to the kerosene and oxygen fuel and oxidizer mix. Also, you will notice that it is black, and that is because of the lightweight carbon composite construction, which we will likely see more of in the future. The Rutherford sea level engine has a thrust of 16.89 kN at sea level and 20.3 kN in vacuum. I didn't have a number for its specific impulse, but it should be in the neighborhood of 300 seconds. Its burn time is also uncertain, but based on the Falcon 9, it is likely that the first stage will burn for at least 2 minutes and 30 seconds and as much as 3 minutes. The second stage vacuum engine has 22 kilonewtons of thrust in its flight regime. Its specific impulse in vacuum will be slightly higher than the sea level version and its burn time is no less than 6 minutes. It is also probably not more than 9 minutes. The estimated cost per launch for the rocket is 4.9 million dollars. Perhaps the most prominent customer for Rocket Lab's Electron is Moon Express, which has received FAA approval to deliver a payload to the moon on this rocket in late 2017. If the mission is successful, it will be a marvel of miniaturization and a showcase of the latest in fabrication technology, and of course, it will be very, very cheap. Rocket Lab hopes that there is enough demand for small satellite launches that it will be able to launch a hundred times per year. On that note, thank you for watching this rocket profile of the Electron rocket.